how to live well financially living well financially and we've got in our midst one financial guru our brother our pastor a wonderful person called pastor aj welcome pastor aj thank you so much um mr ot and thank you coda tv for inviting me to come on this special program that we're putting together about how to live well you know yeah, yeah. all right so I'm going st- awesome so going straight to the point yes. um what is what is finance when we say finance what is it um look it it's um it's a term that we use because we want to describe money yeah you know so money is a current medium of exchange in the terms or in the form of coins or banknotes wow yeah so um the finance is what we go to school to learn mm-hmm. about how to do money and manage money and and balance sheets and all that so um today we're gonna dive into it um and then see what money can do for you mm-hmm. your financial status in life yeah and your way of managing money mm. and that is what we, this program will be about living word um living well like you know with money or finance yeah wow awesome so um when, when we talk about money now you've spoken about finance and you've also spoken about money, yeah? Mm. I also think finance has got to do with everything that has got to do with money, buying, managing money, managing f- finances. Even sometimes finance can go to the extent of maybe considering even our relationships with people because some people are in in, in themselves by themselves they are money even though they are human beings you can use them to buy <laughs> you know what i mean certain people for instance you yourself as you sit here those that know you can confirm this that somebody can buy a product with your name no um let me let me put it people yeah. get a discount with my name no they can actually buy man <laughs> No, you know, you know the, the reason People why I'm saying this, yeah. Mention my name and then they are looked after. Exactly. Yeah, so that's true. That's yeah, true. so whenever there's a need and I want to buy something, yes. right? And if I have the full money and I go, I'll just, I will not ask anything. I'll just pick it and pay for it. Yes. I've bought it. That is using money yeah. to yeah. finance something right. and then so, I get it, right? Yeah. But then if I can walk to a place and say, oh, yeah, my brother, Pastor AJ, sent me here. He yeah. told me to, to, to say you, hello to you for him. That's oh, right. is Pastor AJ your brother? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. How many did you need? That's right. Two, three? Yeah, take it, take it. Take it. No, tell him to call me. That's it. Sometimes we get free things yes. just by mentioning the names of people. That, that's true. Right. That so, so, viewers, true. if your if your father is is an army officer, yeah. your father is a police officer, mm-hmm. in certain countries, yeah. you get away with criminal crime. You understand? You can get away with things because a name is attached. That, so that, is, that happens in Africa, though. Exactly. You know, they're developing <laughs> countries, you know. Not everywhere. You know. But as you're saying about finance and people um, having financial freedom or people using people's name yeah. to be able to exchange goods, you know. Like mm-hmm. It's a management of a large amount of money yeah. in a financial board or in a state. Yeah. Um, most people leave a legacy for their children. Yeah. You know, um, perfect. They leave a worth behind their name mm-hmm. for their children. So that is the level um, or this platform we want to use it to teach people yeah. how to live a life worthy of your calling and leave a legacy behind yeah. for your children, children. Yeah. You know, like inheritance yes you know that is the key factor of living well yeah because look if you don't have money sometimes you might not be able to live well and most of the times okay <laughs> i, I want to quote and unquote because mm. um a lot of christians have different perspective on money okay money matters when you talk about it in the church yeah some people can get offended you know? Oh really? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, but it's not 
because the church is a place of going to receive from God mm -hmm. and also like spiritual matters. Yeah. You know, to deal with your emotions and, and how to overcome the challenges of life. But we forget that money play a bigger role Very in everything big. we do. Yes. So I put down that one of the strongest elements in life is money. Very true. I agree. Yeah. One of the strongest element in life is money. Yeah. Because money is like blood. Mm -hmm. And I've seen the rich and the poor when they're sick. And the reason why I say it's like blood, because if you don't have it, sometimes you can be ill. Yeah. Because you, you think and think and think and imagine and calculate and, and look at your family background and look at the situation in which you're facing and your your mind what do you mean no no like no, no your no, mind, you cannot cast your mind on anybody on imagination and say ah if i call my friend ot i'll be this problem will be solved exactly when you cast your mind and look at your classmate <laughs> <laughs> there's no one bro <laughs> the people you went to school with you know what I mean? Mm. The the school you even graduated from. You, you, there's no one. There's no one. There's no one. And you yourself, even thinking about that, you can be sick. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You, there's that, a that's life situation right. that I I will encourage all our viewers that if you tune in, um, please pay attention because I'll give you some clue. I do with real estate, mm -hmm. and there was a deal. Yeah. That. We, we thought we have calculated everything, you know, LMI and all the insurance and all that. And not knowing that the broker has used the guy's savings to pay the LMI, the, okay. um, um, you know, the lender's mortgage insurance. Okay. And everything, the government taxes and all that. So we were short 25000 He called me and said, Pastor AJ, the broker just told me that we are short 25000 25. I said, hey! This was in 2018. Wow. Do you understand? And I said, what are we going to do? Mm -hmm. I said, okay, give me a minute. So I called my the, my Chinese lady that trains me yep. um, because of privacy. Uh, uh, of I course, you can't mention the name. Yeah. Um, so she said, AJ, leave with me. She went to the bank and then brought 25000 gave it to my friend, and boom, we settled the next day. Wow. I say, whoa. That made me realize the people you hang around with mm. matters. Because I was thinking, which Ghanaian could I call? Why? <laughs> Why not? I call OT? No, no. <laughs> like, I know some Ghanaians are yeah. powerful. Yeah, oh, of course. They got money yeah. and all that. But to go and tell them I'm short, not 2,500. No. no. Not 1,500. Because 2,500 people. Like, yeah. oh, AJ, just take yeah. my next, you know, paycheck. I'll just give it to mm -hmm. you because I know I can guarantee that. But 25K, within a, a minute, yeah. it was released, you know. And I've seen people with that power, the level of power, and I have testimonies upon testimony, those who have like 200,000, 300,000. So to, to be able to understand how to create worth and hang around with people mm -hmm. that are worthy it's very, very good. Okay, so this brings us to another yeah. thing that we can discuss. Mm -hmm. I think you've already touched on why people are so attached to money because yes. you've already explained, but then it will still come in, keep coming through. So is it so difficult to make money? Yes and no. Okay, so why yes? Yes, if you discover a product. Mm-hmm. Or a service yep. for humanity. Okay. Easy. Money will follow. No, because it is very hard to crack your brain to discover something that human being can use or consume. Okay. I th as in something humans will be interested in. Yeah, anything that is serviceable mm -hmm. for human being. Yeah. There are I believe that I always say when I, I, I advise people. There are three industries okay. that you need to get into. Anybody, three industries. Okay. Number one, industry of business that you should get into, food business. Food. 
agricultural, like farm, whatever that people consume. Okay. Yeah? If you're in that industry, you make money. Why do I say that? Everybody eat. That's right. Everybody drink. That's right. Everybody will need fruit or salad or whatever it is that we produce mm-hmm. from the farm into the um, the supermarket. Yeah. You will be if you're a delivery guy or in that blockchain of business, you will make it. Yeah. Even if you buy a truck to transport it, you will make yeah. it. Okay. Even if you are a chef or a restaurant. You will make it. So, you, in essence, you mean you can? It's best to stick to any consumable business. That, but you can take any part of that chain. That chain. It's a blockchain. It's yeah. Nobody, no one person can do it. It's a solid, it's a big huge one. one. Yeah. I even go um like somebody approached me for cash, cashew nuts. Okay. You know? Like Lebanese people and all that. So you have to be able to connect with people mm-hmm. that will connect you with your ideas. You understand? Come, say that again. You have to be able to connect with people that will connect you with your ideas. Perfect. So it's good to have ideas. Mm-hmm. But if you don't have the right connection, your ideas will be dormant. Yeah. will be stuck in your head. That's so true. when you're in that industry of agriculture or like food industry, number one, because every human being will eat first. Yeah. Okay. The next thing that anyone should get involved is real estate. Okay. <laughs> what do I mean by real estate? Nobody will go and buy a house or rent a house if they have not eaten. After you are full, yeah, you have eaten. The yeah. next thing is that you want to sleep yeah. somewhere. So even if it's a shed mm-hmm. that you're building in anywhere in the world, people will rent it or of people will buy it. Yeah. So if you get into real estate, real estate has different levels. Yeah. The acquisition of land. Some people will be walking to assassin, mm-hmm. what so. Some people will acquire the land and sit on it. Yeah. And waiting for people to come and knock on their door. All right. It doesn't matter where about in the world. Land is mwah. Because the Oof. land, the same land can be used for farming. Of course. So while you're sitting on it, just grow vegetables. You and see, it's intertwined. Even with what you're saying, I've never heard the price of land coming lower. It always keeps rising. Because population. Yeah. And it's, it's the same thing. And, yeah, demand and supply. It doesn't matter which country. Everywhere is the same. No new land is being manufactured. But there are land that is valuable <laughs> yeah. and there are land that is not valuable. It depends on the demand. You can okay. have a land in Metagon. Yep. It's worth nothing. Okay. Acreage is there. Nobody is going to use it. So they can't pass in a place where it's easy to assess things. Yeah. That is why they release the land in the stages yeah. in Australia. I, I don't Ghana yeah. everywhere it it's be the, the same. same. But I think even in Metagon, all mm. the farthest places where it's of no value now, mm. it's just the condition of now. Yes. But so leaving it with time, yeah. With, with like every seven years, in the index, there, there is a growth. Yeah. Of 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 your property or your land or anything. So you can all check this. Uh, it's, it's available on the Service News yeah. South Wales um, index. And, w- and one thing I want to add to it is, you know how you've taught us how we can start creating money yeah. with the ideas. Yes. I also think we can have a fourth one. Yes. So you've taught us how to make money by food, by no, real estate, finished. and then we have another no, one. No, no, yeah. I haven't finished the third There's one. another one, yeah. There's a three. Three one that yeah. is common, that everybody can get involved. That's right. So real estate is that if you buy and rent or you buy to live in and mm-hmm. hold it, it will grow in equity. Yes. And then just, just buy and rent. I have a module that I teach people, you buy and rent. Yeah, we'll go through that. And, and okay. Another stage. The last one is medicine or herbal. Or pharmaceuticals. Yeah. Pharmaceutical. Okay. Why do I say that? Everybody that has eaten and then they sleep, mm-hmm. the next thing is that they will save their money to be able to kill their diseases. That's right. Nobody on earth. You see, when you're sick, that's where you know how much people love you. Oh, yeah. Yeah? At your weakest point. Every, they will do fundraising. They will do GoFundMe. They, but why you have strength? Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, no. I you Fight it yourself <laughs> till you die. Then we take over from where you left off. <laughs> you see, people will spend their last dollar yeah. to kill their disease. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? That's true. When there is trouble. So if you're in that industry, whether you're doing herbal um, medicine, like our traditional one, you see, like 
people are now doing well with the sobolo yeah. and the ginger drinks and all that. That's I would encourage you to do that. But again, don't think small. Partnership with somebody and then make it a commercial business. Yeah. Because those uh, medi uh, medicinal drinks, yeah. if there's a word, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you mix it with um, ginger and garlic, other and, garlic other. and herbs and all that. Yeah. It's good for the cold weather here. Of course. Do you understand? Yeah. So please, I will encourage you if you're in it, partnership with somebody. The another thing that people don't let their money grow is that they don't partnership. Yeah. They want to do everything by themselves. Yeah. So those three industries if you are involved in any of them you will do well and the fourth one i wanted to add yes sir is the um aspect of people okay people my people finance i'll call it people finance, <laughs> people finance. that's where heard. you come in yeah, we're creating it that. today yeah people yeah. finance people okay, finance I'll, I'll, I'll do that uh, that's people, the fourth uh, fourth one is yeah. people finance okay Th that's right explain it, that to me okay this is the meaning of what yeah. i'm trying to say by people finance yes man of god there yeah. are certain people in this life as i mentioned earlier yeah. that if you are strategically positioned in society mm -hmm. There are certain things that you buy with people which money cannot buy. Yes. Help. Yes. Money can't buy help. Yeah. Honesty and people that will represent you. Yes. Money can't buy. Look, you can have all these good products we've listed up here. That's right. Somebody can talk ill of you, mm. ill of the product somewhere, go and everything down. goes down. That's true. That's true. Right. So you need the people finance where those people can even look at how much you are trying mm. and somebody out of their own way will connect you. They don't have physical cash to give you, but they can mention your name and yeah. say, go and talk to this man. I know he can help. That's true. That is true. That's happened a lot that you connect somebody to another person. I've, look, um, and it it's, comes it's, with, it they comes say with that good name is better than riches. riches yeah. yeah that's true and you know it comes with also building it like a business like yeah. you building the food business yeah. real estate business building the pharmaceutical business you also build people biz, people finance yeah. in a sense that somebody would have to prove himself to be very credible in society so yeah. much that his worth will count that's true yeah, that's true. And it takes years, just like you use years to build a business to grow in any yeah, of these, yeah, I mean, yeah. departments. Mm -hmm. Kennedy Japan once said something yeah. that I think his son wanted to do a business or somebody wanted to do it. I think it was his son. He yeah. went to China or somewhere to get yeah. some products for yeah. sale. Mm -hmm. When he got there, they said any check coming from the developing country, especially Ghana, they are not going to grant the goods ahead of before so, yeah. they, they cash the money. Mm -hmm. Then someone working in the factory came out and saw Ken, which is yeah. Kennedy Japan's son. Yeah. He was like, hey, Ken, what are you doing here? Yeah. yeah. Like, oh, yeah, I'm coming to get A, A B, C, D, E. Then the bit, but then it's been, been a bit of a difficulty. Then the son, the worker said to their executives, yeah. if this man's father is Kennedy in Japan, yeah. then they will pay the money, That's release right. the goods. Yeah. Done. That, done. Because he has trained his name with honesty and integrity. And so there is money. On him on, on, as a person, yes, that's true. even though he's got but money that, in his pocket, that, is that like, credibility what we is call there. Is is a guarantor? Yes. Um, in any field, that's right. Where somebody can use a name mm -hmm. to guarantor you to release a good. Perfect. Uh, in, in in even going for a job, you need a reference. Re will use your name as a reference, and then the moment they see oh, Pastor AJ or Ebenezer on there, they 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 are pissed because yes. it's oh. The if he's coming from this source like most most people ask me like why are you in everything i'm like look i'm not in it for myself mm -hmm. sometimes um i put myself there like even jobs yeah i can call people right now if you need any job and then i say oh so so and so need a job then they will connect you yeah because i'm referring you to the job yeah whether you want to work in the restaurant whether you want to work in construction whether you want to work in accounting or whatever feel that you are involved the most common one that i can get you a job with my eyes closed is that if you want to do sales yeah you know, because that one you don't even need to put resume yeah uh, just get it done and you I just put I just, it in and it starts yeah it, it's done so we have built life that we are connected in such a way that we want to serve the community so some people are in the, by themselves money yeah yeah that's because true. you can use their name 
as a medium of transaction, like yes, you sir. explain money. Yeah. If I can mention your name and mm -hmm. I can get a product in my hand, yep. then I bought it with your name. That's true. That's true. Even if it was a discount. Yeah. You know yeah, what I mean? Because my true. money wasn't enough. You can't go to a company, a shop where a product is tagged hundred dollars. Yes. And then say you want to pay ninety. You're not getting it. That doesn't say so true. if somebody's name can let you pay even $99 dollars. instead of $100, yeah. then that person's name is money. That's true. And you've been able to trade with it. So yeah. I believe that we need to connect ourselves with people that have made the, their names money, useful. Mm. I mean, reputable names which you can mention and get away with things. Good things, of course. Yeah. And then we should also try to live our lives like that so that we can also be money That's true. to other people. That's true. Um, because um, I, I, I remember... Some people went to a, a function hall, like, you know? Yeah. And they mentioned my name, and the guy said, oh, if you know AJ, then we'll give you a discount. Exactly. You know what I mean? Like, this is a reception hall. So if you're looking to do a wedding, um, you know, call us, call mm -hmm. me, or call um, Koda TV. Yeah. We'll be able to connect you. We want to we wanna show you a way that you don't need to struggle. You don't need to struggle to reinvent the wheels because it's already done. And the, I, the, I said the that phone I, numbers are the phone number is under the bottom of the screen okay, so you can pick there. it up. It's, I said that um, when we talk about money, people not having and they can die. I've seen a lot of poor people that they have sickness and they couldn't pay for their bills, bills yeah. and they die. And I've seen a lot of rich people that they have sickness because of their money. They were mm. able to get the best medicine. That's right. And they're still alive. That's true. And I've also seen the poor becoming rich by somebody investing in them. Yes. Especially people in academia. Yeah. Um, you see that this kid is very smart, but they lack the necessary um, financial help. That's true. And somebody will sponsor them to go yeah. to school. And through that, they have become very, very smart. That's so true. So money can be invested or in, in life and you become somebody, especially those with talent, those with gift to become yeah. sports um, like people and also become great academians. Yeah. Because somebody invested money in you, you can do well. I want us to look at a scripture because somebody will say, oh, but Pastor AJ, it might not be in the Bible. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go to Luke chapter, <laughs> Luke chapter 19. Yeah, about how to multiply your money. Uh, before we do that, let's look at the same Luke chapter 16. Yeah, Luke chapter 16, um, men of God. And look at, see, even God, Jesus is not compared. What, what verse is that? Um, I'm doing the, the passion. Do you have the passion translation? Passion? Yeah, the passion is TPT. Or you can do any amplify or whatever. Uh, amplify is maybe good. you can do NIV. NIV, yeah. Luke chapter 16, um, verse number 13. Luke 16, 13. Okay, start from 12. Yeah, read that. Okay. Luke chapter 16. Okay, just a minute. Luke 16. Yeah, it's a very powerful scripture. Verse it, what? Um, verse 13, 12. Verse 12. Yeah. Okay, I highlight this. Yep. And I will send that to the screen. Okay, read it for us. And look at what the scriptures say. And we'll go to Luke chapter 19 later. And it's, you see, it's important that when you look at all the great men of God. Okay. Yes. So Luke chapter 16, 16 verse 12. Yep. It says, and if you have not been trustworthy with someone else's, mm -hmm. someone else's property, yeah. who will give you property of your own? That's right. Mm -hmm. continue. continue 13 yeah okay 13 says no one can serve two masters yes. either you will hate the one and love the other yeah or you will be devoted to the one mm -hmm. and despise the other mm -hmm. you cannot serve both god and money okay yeah so money is very very important yeah yeah the 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 bible does not say you cannot serve god and the devil yeah Do you understand so it is very good that we, we we master how to use money. Yeah. Because when you're poor, it makes you do a lot of poor things. Yeah. You make poor decisions. You you act poorly. Yeah. You think poorly. You cut down on everything. <laughs> Even drinking water. <laughs> 
and and you 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 don't strive in life yeah but when you surround yourself with people that have a rich mind yeah you know see a- again to make money as i said it could be easier it's it's the mind okay it's the mindset okay some people think poorly some people don't want to take risks hmm. the the money is in their bank account i don't believe that i believe in that every money should be working Oof. don't you work i do yeah so my money is working for me Okay. I learned that from a pastor um, when I was young. He said, young man, to make it in this country, you have to let your money work for you. So in essence, your first employee is your money. Yes. It has to work. Put your money into a... Turn into your money into a worker, okay. a worker like, for you. Like one of my philosophies is that if you have more children, yeah, imagine you have more children and they're all working, you have more money. Yeah. Okay, so if you have more money and the money has been invested... Then it multiplies. Yeah. So, yes, I believe in savings, but every savings that you accumulate, it needs to be working. That's right. Don't leave your money in the bank because the bank is trading your money to mm-hmm. make money. All right. Let's look at that in Luke chapter 19. Somebody will be thinking, I'm just making this up. It's all in the scriptures. Yeah. Okay. The multiplication of money. Okay? Luke 19. Luke 19. Yeah. Luke 19. Verse. Give me one minute. Let me go there. Luke uh, chapter 19. 19 um, verse... Wow. So today we, we're digging into finance and money. Yeah. And Pastor AJ is making us understand some of the things that money can do for you and I. And how we can raise this money. And as believers, as Christians or whatever you believe in, there are good reasons why we should be able to do something special to make sure our monies are multiplied. Okay. So we're um, reading this verse now. 19 verse 25. Luke chapter 19 verse number 25. All the way to um, 27. Yeah. Okay. It says, Sir, they said, he already has 10. Then 24, 26. Okay. Start from 24, 24. So 24. Then he said to those, he said Seven. to those standing by, mm-hmm. Take his miner away from him yep. and give it to the one who has 10 miners. Then 25, mm. sir, they said, he, he already has 10. Mm. Then he replied, I tell you that, n- that to everyone who has, more will be given. Yeah. But as for those who has nothing, even what they have, what they have will be taken away but those enemies of mine who did not want me to to be king over them bring them here and kill them in front of me okay so in other words if you don't know how to multiply money Mm -hmm. what you have will be taken away from you yeah and that is what in 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 economics those are the consumers wow we that don't create product Mm -hmm always consume other people's product yeah so indirectly we're giving our money back to them yeah i said this and i said this uh with all respect that if the government gives everybody one million in our bank account yeah in in seven days some people will, will go be, borrowing will, no will, the money will roll back to the rich people oh yeah because they have the mindset they can use to redirect your money into themselves exactly they will create something a product that you be interested needed. in yeah yeah why somebody will win a lot of 10 million 100 million and then they're poor again okay so it, it is good to have a mindset of educating yourself or be friends with people that understand the principle of business and how to make money thank you so in conclusion in conclusion i'll read my version he said the king said to his other servant, take the money he has and give it to the faithful servant who multiply my money 10 times over. But the master, but master, the other servant objected. Why it is, uh, why do we give it to him? He already has so much. Yeah. And that is most people. When somebody is rich, we complain about the rich person. Yeah. Instead of going to the rich person and, and ask them, how are you doing, my brother? 
that's one of my secrets. I go to everybody. If I don't have, I go to my seniors mm. in the ministry. Like I go to um, Prophet um, Richard um, Amwaye. Amwaye. I'll go to Bishop um, Richard. You see all of them, Richard, Richard. Of all course. the Richard. If you want to be friends and be rich, be friends with Richard. All right. <laughs> because the Richards are rich. <laughs> no, they have a mindset yeah. of success. Yeah. They have a mindset of to discipline you how to do things well. Yeah. I, I remember Bishop gave me the best advice of my life. You understand? Yeah. And he said, Kweku, wherever I go, I, I hear your name. So I, I will encourage you to get into politics. Mm. And he sponsored me as well. And I want to say thank you, Bishop. Wow. He gave me $1,000 to fund my campaign. Wow. You understand? So he didn't just say that. He acted on it. Yeah. yeah. But these are people, puppets are in the kingdom. When you need advice, when you need wisdom, you go to them. Yeah. Because they have it. Exactly. So associate yourself with people with good mindset yeah and then you become good that's true i'll leave it with that all Amen. right so thank you so much um viewers i believe you've had everything that you need to have concerning money and finance expect more we're gonna get some um financial, technical people, yeah, yeah, some yeah, financial yeah, yeah. advice i'm not a financial advisor and i'm just a, a he's a, a financial advisor no, who, no, no, no. who who has not <laughs> got in the authorization to no, do no, so no, 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 no. and so we will get to get you somebody that is authorized and accredited yeah to speak to you financially yes and then they will throw more light onto these things confirm some of these things but don't forget that today we know that we can possibly venture into food agriculture pharmaceuticals yep. and people finance let's look into these things and our lives will be a better thing. And, and every every Monday, we'll be coming to you um, yeah. just to give you some education on these topics of living well or yeah. how to live well That's or how right. to live a better life. I That's love right. people to live well because it's scripture. And please, if you haven't subscribed, yeah. please subscribe to Coda TV. Yeah. And um, the, is it the notification yeah. button? The button, so, yeah. And then also, if you have any questions you can write it to us on facebook or, or by um, way of comments we will, we yeah, will get yeah, it just do comment and if this has blessed you and you want to be our sponsor we welcome you That's we need right. money mm -hmm. um to bring you this um beautiful podcast yeah and i i want you to encourage everybody when we call you in the community we're going to be talking about health yes um we're going to be talking about other matters yeah. that we face, yeah. marriage, um, we we want to do well in our and then, marriage and education yeah. as well. We will, um, have to, you know, choose the right career path. Yeah. You know, we got expert doctors and um, people in the Academia sector to yeah, help, yeah. of university and they will come here and we will get the politicians to come as well. That's right. Um, my friends that will yeah. tell you what is going on. So Coda TV is going places. That's and right. Please put your money into it. Invest in Coda TV mm -hmm. because you never regret it. That's right. Thank you, Mr. Beneza. Thank you too so much. So viewers, yes, we're gonna be dealing with living well overseas. That's in any of the developed countries and living well in Africa, of course, where we come from. But then when we get it wrong and we jumble the two together, then life becomes hard. Yes. How can we live well in Australia by living well in Africa? How, can we live well in both sides or we can only focus on one? What can we do? Expect a lot of mind-bothering programs, but I'm also we expect you to share your comment because yes. we want to hear from you. Yes. So type your comment at the bottom of the screen. And if you want to join us in studio and you live in Sydney, call us. Even if you live anywhere around the world, yeah, we can, can send you the yeah, link, link to still any, join, yeah, in, join in and then we have a chat on yeah. how to live well and any other topic that you want us to talk about productive topics yes not abuses and assaults no 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 so we don't we don't <laughs> we want to grow because we've we been want, sorted we for want, so long we didn't get anything you see it's so true that when you hear positive words yeah you grow it's, it's a mental game yeah. it be, you become what you hear that's right yeah you know so we want to feed you with good stuff and uh, right. if i say anything that it was offensive to you or I, I i didn't put it well you can call me 
or text me and you right. just correct me and say, okay, yeah. maybe um, you could have AJ gone this here, way. You could have gone this way or that way. Or maybe you have other opinions. That's you know. it. Uh, look, it may I, not be a it, bad thing we said, but it may only be a different opinion you have. Share with me. Bring I want to grow. That's know? right. And Thank you, you so much. Well. Thank you. And see you next time. Bye. It's been your brother, AJ and Koda. Yes. Bye.